Right, the last one is excels at drifting. That's what I mean. It's got no grip, so it's not surprising. With amazing handling, you should test it out in his next race. See if you can skid at least five times and still win. Oh, I think I'm above that recommended PR for a change. Big time above it. Skid at least five times and win. What's it? We reckon four laps. Got to be four laps, on it? I'm going for four laps. Right, so they're all. Well, that all left tights was there a Merc chucked in there? I think I might go to. Uh, I might go to take a few out. I think. Three laps, aren't I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and take them all out. Come on! Well, it's 22. I don't get 22. See what I can get. Mind you, I might not even win. Well. Messing about here. Well, obviously, I've done no skids as yet. I seem to make up my own challenges when I do them, uh, this, especially events these days. How so much have we counted that so far? Four. Need one more, but I'm quite a bit behind. Well, I'll naturally get that anyway, because I won't know where the, where the grip of it is anyway. Is that it there? That didn't count. I will come to lap people as well. I've made a bit of a pig here, it is, haven't I? Oh, just about. Just about. Uh, don't really know what to make of that car after today. I would say, bearing in mind it's got a lot of upgrades already, I would say nowhere near worth the money. Nowhere near it. And I love Jex, absolutely love Jex. But that car is a gold pit. I mean, 500 gold does cost. I mean, I know it's not... Um, all about the upgrade cost but to buy that car when I was going through the game something similar would have cost you I don't know 300,000 or something well no not even that do you know it's been that long ago since I've done it that I can't really remember the cost of anything the only one I do remember was the Audi R18 2014 LMP car because it was the last car I saved up to buy and that was four million racing dollars when I bought that and that took forever it seemed to buy that car that is a long time ago now I know some of the cars like 660,000, 100,000 that car I mean that's 500 gold that's got so far to upgrade that that is not worth it's probably worth a tenth for that I reckon 
Well, I shouldn't really be saying all that, but so as you find it, eh? I don't think that's a um, certainly not going to be a car. Another car that I will be driving very often. I think the trouble is when you get all the cars like I have, I think you then get a little bit spoiled for choice. So cars that are, you know, obviously pretty good compared with things like Nissan Zilvias and what have you. Because you have got the, you know, all the LMP cars and F1 cars and stuff. Most cars do do tend to feel pretty crap. Has made an impression on you. It certainly has. I've just been talking about it. Funnily enough, it's a wonderful car, Zoe. Haha! <laughs> I didn't know he was listening. I will let you in on a secret. There is a trade sponsor. Trade sponsor. What does that mean? Sponsor has got two F types to give away if you are willing to work for them. Right, so we've got Catalonia tomorrow, which for me is only three hours. So I'll be back for stage two at that point. I've got no idea what they're on about two F types. Uh, I won't be driving one of them, so there's no point in giving me another one. Uh, we'll see how we go uh, for that one. Good luck with you if you've not started that yet. Um, but straight away I can see that is that is a proper gold pit and uh, I think you'd probably be well advised to spend a little on that and try and get it by all or by crook like I'm going to do on the next lot of series after uh, well on the next update probably uh, anyway see you at stage 2 if you're about in a few hours time see you then cheers